Have you ever wondered how many types of pumps exist and what are their features? Pumps are operating machines for moving liquids or gases, thanks to some mechanical parts that are powered by a rotary or alternative rectilinear motion. Nowadays, they are widely used in different industry fields, but they have already existed since the 3rd century BC, thanks to Archimedes, who invented the famous Archimedes screw, which was able to move big quantities of fluid and it's still used for water purification. Jaws, the leader in industrial spare parts supply for more than 10 years, offers its catalog of any kind of pump from leading manufacturers. Pumps can be classified in many ways, but usually they are divided in fluid dynamic or hydraulic. When a hydraulic pump operates, it creates a vacuum at the pump inlet, which forces the liquid from the reservoir into the inlet to the pump and by mechanical action delivers this liquid to the pump outlet which forces it into the hydraulic system. Infusion The liquid is pumped through for a variation in the chamber volume. The first type needs to be constantly fueled with energy to be operated. In order to increase the fluid speed inside the pump to higher levels compared to the outlet, Fluid dynamic pumps can be classified in centrifugal pumps. They are the most common type among fluid dynamic pumps. This kind of pump uses the centrifugal force of the rotor to move the liquid by transforming the mechanical energy coming from its motor into the kinetic energy and later into pressure energy. They are employed for both industry and domestic use and they can be classified in two types based on their construction with a cantilever impeller and with the double support impeller. Centrifugal pumps, depending on the drive shaft's arrangement that moves the impeller, are distinguished in horizontal access pumps and vertical access pumps. Also, they are classified based on the direction of the flow. Radial, if the outlet is orthogonal to the section or axial if the outlet and the suction are on the same axis. Centrifugal pumps are also classified by the number of rotors they have. They can be single-stage or multi-stage pumps. According to the fuel that they are using, they are distinguished in electric pumps if they use electric energy to work or motor pumps if they are fueled by petrol. Turbo pumps, designed to increase the pressure of a liquid or gas, in order to improve the power or performance of a motor through a sort of rotodynamic pump combined with a triggering turbine. Almost all of them are built following the axial or centrifugal design. Volumetric pumps, instead, add energy periodically. They exploit the change of the volume in a chamber to cause suction or a push of the fluid. They can be classified in rotary pumps, they are volumetric pumps made of a chamber that contains gears, lobes, vanes, or similar elements guided by a rotating shaft, which characterize the most common type lobe pumps, vein pumps, gear pumps, and screw pumps. Alternative pumps. In this kind of pump, the change of volume is obtained with an alternating sliding piston inside a cylinder that forces the fluid to slide in one direction only and that prevents the backflow during the return of the piston. They can be divided in single acting pumps if the piston slides in one direction or double acting pumps if the piston slides in both directions. Alternative volumetric pumps can also be divided into suction pumps where the piston produces a vacuum that forces the liquid to lift along a tube. The fluid is then expelled from the pump at ambient pressure conditions. Force pumps. The fluid enters the cylinder at the ambient pressure and is lifted for effect of the pressure and is lifted for the effect of the pressure. Suction and force pumps, which integrate both functions. We have analyzed all kinds of pumps on the market, their characteristics and where they need to be used. 
Do you already know them? Let us know in the comments. If you think this video was useful to you, please let us know by leaving a like and a comment. You can also share it. And don't forget to subscribe to our channel. We suggest that you visit our website, jawscompany.com, to find out more about our next projects.